Let's write a C program to swap two numbers using pointers and functions. I'll take two integer variables a and b and ask the user to enter values for a and b. The first value entered by the user is for variable a and the second value entered by the user is for variable b. So I'll store that inside the address of variable a and b. So address of variable means ampersand a and ampersand b. I'll call a function called swap and pass the address of variable a and address of variable b. Remember we are not passing values, we are passing address of a and address of b. So inside main function itself I'll print out the values of a and b after swapping it. So swapping logic is present inside the function swap which we are going to write. So let me copy this. Our function swap doesn't return anything so its return type is void. Void swap. Since we are passing address of a and address of b, we will take pointer variables here. Pointer variable x and pointer variable y. So address of a is present inside pointer variable x and address of b is present inside the pointer variable y. So star x gives the value present at the address x and star y provides the value present at address y. So I'll take a temporary variable temp and swap the values of star x and star y that is pointer variable x and pointer variable y. So, so the point the value present at pointer variable x is transferred to temp the the value presented pointer variable y is transferred to x and the value presented temp is transferred to pointer variable y. So this swaps the value of pointer variables x and y and hence the value presented a and b. Okay, We are directly accessing the address of uh, variables a and b. So when we change the value of a value of uh, value of variables a and b using its address it it reflects all over the program so we need we need not return anything so i wrote the prototype there and pasted the definition at the bottom so let us check the result so i'll give 100 and 300 100 for a and 300 for b so a value should be 300 and b value should be 100 after swapping and it's working. Okay, let me show you once again in the code. The first value entered by the user is for a and the second value entered by the user is for b. Okay, so let me run the program once again and I'll give a value as 30, 3, 0 and b value as 20. After execution, it, it must get swapped a is equal to 20 and b is equal to 30 and it's working. So this is how we swap two numbers using pointers and functions. Please write this program yourself and execute it. If you have any doubts, please follow the link present in the description section of this YouTube video and ask your question at the, in the comment section of our blog. So please visit the link present in the description section of this YouTube video for source code notes and discussion about this topic. Please stay subscribed to our YouTube channel and blog and please do not forget to, to share this video with your friends on WhatsApp, Telegram, LinkedIn, Twitter, Facebook, etc. And please do not forget to like this video on YouTube. Thank you.